Welcome back to another review of H1Z1 and the brand new patch that they have released today on February 20th of 2015. First, we're gonna take a look at a most awaited feature is the change of the gate. As you can see here, they've changed the gates and made them much bigger. But as you can see, the gate is now massive. It's actually very hard to get over this gate as you could see which this part of the gate is what they have increased in height uh, you can't even seem to be able to jump over it normally there is no way to actually get over it by jumping you would need to put down another barrel for you to be able to jump up over that so at least now it requires three three barrel stacks to get over instead of just simple one. Now, let's get to the new recipes that they have implemented within the game and on this new brand new patch. By combining metal brackets, metal sheet and nails, you will now discover an upper level shelter which came out on February 20th in a new patch. By combining nails, metal brackets, metal sheet, and wooden planks, you will discover upper level large shelter. By combining wooden stick, metal brackets, and nails, you will discover a backpack frame. By combining metal bracket, nails, wooden stick, and two wooden planks, you will discover upper level stairs so you could now have a second floor it doesn't seem that you are able to stack metal walls on top of the other ones and there doesn't seem to be a recipe that involves discovery of metal walls if you would look at the previous recipes for the upper shelter for uh, upper level shelter and large shelter and upper level stairs the components for them is almost exactly that are required for the regular level stairs for example let's see eight nails four metal brackets eight wooden sticks eight wooden planks as you can see you have structural stairs right here and it requires eight wooden sticks eight nails eight wooden planks four metal brackets basically the same thing you would put into discovery to find it but just things here are in reverse and in just different numbers Therefore, the wall should be also discovered, the upper level wall should be discovered the same way, but it doesn't seem it was implemented on the February 20th patch. As you can see, trying to place a regular wall even though it looks like it snaps in there is nowhere to place it there as you could see it says cannot place object at this location now let's build what we have currently discovered by standing next to the chest you are able to craft straight out of it without have to well put it the stuff into your inventory as you could see I have the resources in my chest, I'm standing within the vicinity, and now I can build all of the upper level stuff, except for the walls that, well, they forgot to implement or something happened with them. There is no, currently no discovery for them. I tried every combination and it says nothing on the sheets of metal or nails when I go to discovery. So, upper level shelter, just click craft. As you can see, it takes a ton of resources. There we have crafted our upper level shelter. Now the next thing we're gonna cr uh, craft is upper level shelter. Which requires 16 nails, eight metal brackets, six metal sheets. Gonna give it a moment to craft. And now we have finished crafting that. 
next thing to craft is upper level stairs. As you can see, these three alone are extremely resource heavy, so prepare a lot of resources. Now, let's go place them outside. Now, once you're ready to place them, you click upper level. But for demonstration's sake, I'm gonna first move. You cannot seem to be able to place them on the first level at all. The upper level ones can only be placed on the second level. I'm trying to place it right now and as you can see here, cannot place the object at this location in my chat menu, but I can easily place them over here, including over const on the constructural stairs, quite easily like that. But you can also place them like this as to use additional as additional walls. Technically, you could also place them like this currently where they hang off uh, the side. Like seriously, it's kind of quite interesting to watch. But for now, we're going to show how you could place it across. Now, I decided to place it right here. And so, you know, so I could use it as a wall, even further wall off the other side while they still repair the double walls, you know, upper level walls. You place it down and voila, there you go. You have now made yourself an upper level large shelter. Now. The regular shelter, of course, works under the same principle. You just put it next to it and you could build it. Unfortunately, it seems like you cannot build it on top of the constructural stair. And it doesn't seem like you can build constructural stairs, upper level constructural stairs on it, except for on other large sheds. Just for demonstration's sake, I'll put it right here. Yeah, I like them like this. And here you go. This is how it looks from the other side, as you could see. It looks quite actually massive now. Now, if you open the gate, this is how it looks like. Somebody managed to get in and build these stairs here. This was not definitely not part of the plan, but whatever. And there's no way we could ta currently take them down. And I just noticed my, my character is starving. For example's sake, and for demonstration's sake, I decided to show you guys, as I mentioned earlier in the video, that you could now make hanging sheds. I'm pretty sure you were able to make them earlier, but just to remind you guys that this is now also available, you could create some unique looking things if you would like to with them. I'm pretty sure you're wondering how far can you stack these things. Unfortunately on these, on upper level sheds, you cannot put regular sheds you would think that you'd be able to put other upper level sheds on it. Unfortunately, as you could see, you can't. Here it auto snaps and here it doesn't. We can try the same experiment with upper level uh, stairs, but I tried earlier, I mean, and it also did not work. So therefore you could only have a two-level base. Thank you all for watching another patch review on H1Z1 brought to you by Gang Glitches. There will be a follow-up video once the upper level walls are fixed, uh, you know, by the developers. I don't know what happened to them. As usual, if you like my video, please click like, please click subscribe. 
if you haven't yet and please check out my twitch stream the, uh, that i stream across uh, many games you know and uh, do different things and guides and tutorials and explanations and just playthroughs so check it out and I, i'm sure you won't regret it and again thank you all for watching my video and please be safe in the world of h1z1